Hello everyone, this is Golden Cataway and welcome back to another video. Today I'm doing a top 10, top 10 of my favourite Xbox 360 games on the Xbox 360. So we're going to start with my 10th favourite game, which is FIFA 14. This was my 10th, it was going to be my 11th, so it wasn't on the list. But it just squeezed in because it was really exciting to play and it's really fun to play because like it's really exciting and enjoyable and I feel like football is a game for you. So that's why I like it and personally I think it could improve by, um, well I don't know, adding a few more teams in or something because FIFA on the DS that I've got has actually got a lot of football teams so that's my 10th. My ninth favourite is Call of Duty Ghosts. I don't really like playing 16 games, but there will be a few on this list. And it's because it's in a, it's in a fun, it's a fun um, game, gun game. And you can pick to play Black Ops or things like that. So that's why I like it. Because it's, well, I don't know, but... Because you can play the gun games on, and like there's different things to select from, and a lot of opportunities to do. So that's my ninth favorite. Is it's Call of Duty Ghosts. My eighth, my eighth favorite is Grabbed by the Ghoulies. Because this is in a, a fun game where you're someone who has to go around a haunted house and go and kill all these googlies. So the skeletons, there's mummies, uh, like you can see on the cover, and uh, yeah, it's a three plus. So you can play it if you're a three year older. And it's an Xbox game, but we could get it, which is really good as well. And that's fun. And this one was my eighth. My seventh is, well, this Pure and Lego Batman in the same, like, DVD box. Um, or video game box. And they're, like... Like the same, like the same amount of fun. So Pure is basically like a motorbike game where you go around race courses, and there's a lot of opportunities when you when you're selecting your motorbike and your person and things. And so that's quite good. And Lego Batman is where it's really fun because me and my brother were playing it, and it was really fun because like it's like so like crazy and like it's clever as well because it's just, like really clever things in it and it's really clever how like you go to onto the different mission things so that's was number seven and it is batman and the batman video game and pure here we have another 16 game which is skate three and so this is number six and it's about where you're on a skateboard and you try and do tricks and there's lots of levels or places you can go on your skateboard and lots of places and you can actually attack people with this skateboard and then when you get them really mad they actually like well they actually like go and t like tase you with a taser or the wacky or things or then on the screen comes like hashtags and exclamation marks and things like that but it doesn't actually say they're real you know so that was number six, and it's get three. Next, we have the um, Lego Marvel Avengers, which we've done in a video um, when we did it with Joe. Joe was in that video, so go and check it out. Just type in Golden Cowboy Lego Marvel video. And so it's really fun because there's a lot of characters you can select for when you unlock them. And the missions are really exciting because, um, well, it comes... Like, well, they're really exciting because, like, you can fight bad guys. And I really think it's, it's a really good game because you can roll around the city and then go in the castle. It's just, like, really one of those fun games. So that was number five, and it's Lego Marvels. Next, we have Sims 3. It's because it, it's, I like this game because there's a lot of characters you can select from and a lot of opportunities to do things and places to go. But the thing I don't really like about it could have been probably like third on my list instead of fourth is because if you're like a child, like you can't exactly like do things. You can't go to sleep in bed and things. So me and Joe were doing that once, but it wasn't in video and we couldn't work it very well. So... That's why it was down to four space. It could have been third, but this is number four, and it's The Sims 3. 
my next favourite is Fusion Frenzy. I play this game quite a lot and Joe plays it in a video. Joe plays it in a video and it's really cool because you can select for characters and do mini games and things. We usually do the mini games, they're really fun. And because they're really fun, this is third. It's like really exciting because like when me and Joe get excited we start like jumping around for some reason and it get that's why and that's what happens so this is Fusion Frenzy and it is third on the list. Second is Plants vs Zombies Garden Warfare. It's because there's a lot of plants and zombies in it and I like the garden option, like a lot of opportunities, well not a lot of opportunities, but things to select for you could have garden ops and if you went on the multiplayer then you can go on things like no bomb, the taco thing, um, team vanquish, garden of the graveyard, there's a lot, there's a lot of things um, to do on it. Um, like options to select through so this is second on my list and um, currently I've played on it like when it shows your gamer score on th on your Xbox I have played this like that that it comes up as I like it's a thousand on it and that's more than Minecraft and um, Fusion Frenzy and pretty much all the other games so that's why it's second on my list this is Plants vs Zombies Garden Warfare and it's second First, of course, is Minecraft, because this is a game being held for quite a long time, and it's really fun because loads of people play it, and it can go on different versions, and there's battle mini games that you can go on, and there's glide mini games, and there's tumble mini games that have been added to Minecraft to make it more exciting, and it's because you can build a lot of things and just make your own creations on Minecraft, and it's really fun and enjoyable, and if you haven't got this game, I recommend, I recommend getting it, so this was number one. Thank you for watching this video guys, I hope you enjoyed my top 10 on my favourite Xbox 360 games. So thank you for watching and I'll see you guys later. Don't forget to um, smash the like button and subscribe to my YouTube channel and I'll see you later. Bye!